Welcome to another edition of Jacqueline of All Trades and today I come to you with a first impressions for the Skinaz H3 Aqua Booster Line. This was a sample that I got in the mail and I thought, you know, let's give it a shot, but why not film it? We're very public here. So um, this morning I'm gonna use my Clarisonic Mia and this particular line has three steps. The first one is Aqua Booster Foam Cleansing. The second one is the Aqua Booster Essence. And the third one is the Aqua Booster Cream. Now, it's winter here and it's very, very cold. I don't know how it is over there, but during this time, my skin gets super dry so and i get like little flakes so i'm gonna do a little exfoliating and hopefully my face will not fall off so let's get started i have a bowl of water here and uh, i'm just going to first wet my face a little bit i don't think that there are instructions on how to do this but basically that's how we're gonna do it then i'm gonna apply the product the Aqua Booster Foam, and let's see. There we go. And it says that it has a bunch of bubbles. Um, it's actually pretty cute. Uh, it says it's moisturizing and deep cleansing, and it prevents dehydrating because it has hyaluronic acid and it has a lot of foams. So I'm just going to put this doesn't maybe it smells a little bit it smells kind of um, herby and so let's see so that looks about right put it all over the place and I'm just gonna wet my little Mia shake it off and let's get going and of course my Mia is discharged and it doesn't work all right then we will not do that but we will do it with our hands so I'm just gonna wash it off like this. And I guess I'd, ideally, you know, I would do this with a Mia, but hey, technology, you know how that goes. So, so far it feels fine. It doesn't burn, it doesn't feel, um, it feels kind of creamy. And, I don't really know how long you're supposed to do this, but I guess I'm going to do it how the foam, how I would do my other cleansing. I know some of you use your um, personal foaming cups and then they apply to this, um, but you know, being American, this is how we do it. <laughs> no offense to all the Americans who do it right, okay? But I'm just saying, if it works for me doing it in a really crappy way, it will work for you if you do it right. So anyway, it feels a little bit like noxzema in terms of the creaminess of it. Okay. Okay, hopefully. I will stop with the, okay, washes. It actually rinses very nicely. Um, it doesn't leave any residue. It doesn't feel like the, the skin is stripped. Uh, at least certainly not my hands when I use it. Let's see, we're gonna do the face now. So prepare for a close up. <sighs> hey, it's the morning. I hope um, you didn't get too grossed out here. Maybe don't wash this while you're eating. <laughs> okay, let's see a little bit more. Yeah, let's make sure we get it all, especially the ones around the, the hair, the hairline. I tell you, that is one of my pet peeves when I get soap around my hairline. All right, let's see. So I try to use um, a band by the way, this is the Etude Eddy Tools. Awesome. 
It, um, it doesn't compress my big head, so I don't get a headache from it. Um, it's great, and it's like $5, a little bit less. It's a great etude band, etude house band. Okay, so I'm just uh, drying my skin, and I'm sure all of you out there will be much more gentle to your skin, but uh, just for expediency's sake, I figure I'm just gonna do it like this. Okay. So I always, my, um, my eyebrows get all messed up when I wash my face. So what do you think? My, it's supposed to not stimulate the skin. So I see that, you know, it's a little red, but I would expect that after washing my face with any cleanser. Um, it feels super soft. It feels a little bit on the dry side, but not too much. So far, I kind of like it. So let's, um, let's see my hairline. Yeah, that's one thing that I kind of um, get annoyed. But anyway, let's go to step number two, which is the Aqua Booster Essence. And it says, uh, it stores moisture deep into the skin and prevents from dehydrating. And again, because every step has hyaluronic acid, which is a great, um, a great uh, element. So let's just, uh, essence is supposed to be kind of liquid. So let's see what we have here. Oh no, it's kind of a gel. This is interesting. And as you can see, I'm just using the whole packet. Uh, probably, if, if you're a little bit less um, crazy as I am, it feels kind of sticky, sort of a gel actually, it's not like your typical essence. So we're just going to put this here. Okay, it feels nice. There's clearly a ton of products. I'm gonna put some on my top of my hand so they're soft. <laughs> and um, let's see, it takes a little bit to absorb, but that's all right. And um, I don't know, it feels nice. There's a few places in my skin that are a little bit irritated because I, I had some pimples and I put on some, um, it's, a, it's a medical, um, it's a prescription cream, it's a retinoid. So those places where my skin was peeling a little bit because of the acne, it burns a tiny, tiny bit. But you know, it was burning when I put my um, super uh, moisturizing cream Dermacil that is supposed to be super gentle, so I know it's not this product. Okay, so now it looks It looks actually really nice. It looks um, My skin doesn't look particularly stimulated um, It feels very very smidgen uh, tacky, but not too much and then let's just do step number three which is the aqua booster cream and um, it keep, keeps my skin smooth and sleek by providing external moisturizer layers to the dry skin. So let's go for it. This is the Aqua Booster Cream. And let's see how that feels. Okay, it's, it is a cream, but it's not, um, it's not too thick. All right. And we're just going to actually feels really nice. Let's see. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm in a weird mood. So, ooh, it actually feels really nice. Okay. So we're gonna just put it on. And I tell you, I am delighted that my skin has not fallen off. Um, you know, sometimes when you try new products, you know, it's hard to tell how one's skin is gonna react to it, but so far, so good. Um, 
it feels a little bit, it feels super sm smooth actually, very, very smooth. Um, it doesn't feel greasy, like I cannot tell that there's an extra layer. Sometimes even certain foundations make me feel like there's a film, and this one doesn't, doesn't do that. Um, so that's actually really good. I can tell you the one on the skin already um, got absorbed, and the one on my face is almost all absorbed. I can tell that it's there by touching it with my fingers, but not necessarily feeling it um, from my face. You know, I don't feel the film on the face. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this morning video. And um, so far, so good. You know, I probably would try another sample of it, probably for like a, a week or so. And then I decide if this will be my new cleansing um, moisturizing regimen but um, I don't know so far so good so it's the Skinaz H3 aqua booster line and I guess it comes with other other products now I have a ton of great surprises for you guys I've been uncontrollably buying things on eBay skincare lines makeup the whole shebang, I tell you, I have to tell myself, step away from the eBay because this girl has been going crazy lately. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and I can't wait to see you in the next one. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.